most exciting day in Scrapper's life had turned into the saddest day, and now he was running away. Now, the last thing Scrapper wanted was for the big trucks to see him cry. So he held back the tears, but he felt so sad and all alone that he didn't pay attention to where he was going. He went right past the stop sign, and he didn't even see the oncoming traffic. Whoa! Look out! Stop! We're gonna crash! Whoa. Young fella? I'm sorry, sir. I was so busy running away, I didn't see you coming. Ah, running away, is it? Well, now, when I was a lad, I sometimes felt that way myself. You did? That I did. But you know what? What? I always found out that it didn't work. It didn't? Why not? Because every time I ran away, I'd look back there in my truck bed, and it would still be full of whatever was making me sad. It would? It would. Take it from old Gramp Truck. You can never just dump your troubles. You have to face them. But nobody will give me that chance. Oh, and who is nobody? The big trucks back there. I want to work, but they won't let me. They think I'm too young. They call me Peanut and Pipsqueak. Ah, so that's the problem. Come with me, son. I want to show you something. But I don't want to go back in there. Now, sometimes the only way to go forward is to shove yourself in reverse. Now, come on. his own kind of work to do. You see that? Uh-huh. Now take a look at Bulldozer. And Bulldozer has his own kind of work. But how does that help me? Mighty Shear has an even different kind of job. If you're trying to cheer me up, it isn't working. I couldn't do Mighty Shear's job. No, and neither could Bulldozer. But Mighty Shear can't do Bulldozer's job, and Bulldozer can't do Mighty Shear's. Listen to me carefully, son. I'm listening. Everyone has his own kind of job. Everybody can do something that nobody else can do. Not me. I'm too little. Listen to me, son. It's not the size of your wheels that count. It's the size of your heart. Really? Hey, look at me. My axle isn't what it used to be, and I leak a lot of oil, but I can still work. And if I can find a job, so can you. But what is my job? How should I know? You don't know? Nope, I have it the foggiest. Then what am I hanging around here for? Stop! You're staying around because you're going to find your work. I will? You will, lad, I promise. But you have to keep yourself ready. Keep your eyes open. Keep your engine tuned. You'll find it. Oh, sorry. Can't chat anymore. They need my load at the shredder. And I need to get some gas over at the fuel pump. Oh, I wonder if Green Truck is right. I hope he's right. Then I guess it wouldn't hurt me to hang around for a while and see if I can find some kind of work to do. If those big trucks would ever let me do it. Hey, Graham, I could use some gas, too. Golly gee, I almost forgot. We can't get any fuel without the key. The key? The key to the fuel pump. Over there on the office wall. I can get it. and fill 
fill up with gas, but there's one thing we can't forget. What's that, Graham? Always put the pump key back on the wall. Without that key, all us trucks would be in trouble, and trouble is the last thing we want. Attention all trucks, we have an emergency. Report to the assembly yard on the double. Huh? What's this all about? Oh my, I detect a note of urgency here. Trouble. Better move out on the double. I'm hitting the trail, boss. Hitting the trail. Good thing I am pumped up for some heavy lifting.